I've spoken extensively about the actions of several hormones in the gastrointestinal tract. Okay, that's via secretion and absorption. Okay, and um, I think we'll be rounding up. This is the last hormone we'll be talking about, and this hormone right here is uh, the somatostatin. Okay, so somatostatin action on the GI tract. That's regulation of the motility and um, the secretion. So basically, um, somatostatin is a growth hormone inhibitory hormone. It is produced by D cells of the stomach, small intestine, and the pancreas. Somatostatin is also produced by hypothalamus. Okay. So now, what is what are the actions of somatostatin? It inhibits um, growth hormones, and um, thyroid stimulating hormone too. It's also inhibited by what um, somatostatin. So somatostatin also inhibits pancreatic secretion. Okay. All right. It inhibits cholecystokinin. Um, VIP and uh, the GIP hormones. All right, where is the somatostatin? This is a somatostatin. All right, so basically, it's for inhibition. Okay, basically, for inhibition. So now, somatostatin is a hormone that is produced in the hypothalamus, pancreas, and gastrointestinal tract. In the GI tract, the somatostatin reduces what gastric secretion and limits the release of gastrointestinal hormones such as what secretin and gastrin okay it also inhibits the secretion of other pancreatic hormones such as insulin and glucagon okay so basically the action of somatostatin is inhibitory now like you guys just note the areas of production the hypothalamus pancreas and gastrointestinal tract okay just a short one all right there's a somatostatin hormone right the action on GI tract and the action is straightforward just inhibitory okay just note the site of production and everything right and note the other hormones that it inhibits too right and inhibit gaseous secretions too inhibit growth hormone and gaseous secretion right so see you guys in the next year and bye for now